Well, hello everyone, what is going on? It is the Almighty GF and we are here with episode 17 of Assassin's Creed Rogue. In the previous episode, we started off by picking up all of the Uncharted collectibles in the Two Bends of Albany region. Uh, we completed the first mission of Sequence of Four, Honor and Loyalty, which took place at um, Marais Rochelle, where we're basically protecting uh, Colonel Monroe and his men from the assassins led by Kasaga Wase. And led them through, basically escorted them. He told us to meet them at the new place, which we'll be doing pretty soon. And uh, we finished up all the book we had here, which included a couple more collectibles and the hunting challenge. Before we came to Greystone, which is the last region we hadn't explored, the Albany region. To, took down the settlement. Um, and basically did everything here, including another hunting challenge, actually. Um, so I went through Fort Salil. Or Solisle, however you pronounce it, because that's the region we're going to go to after um, Memory 2. Uh, there aren't any Uncharted Glatzbos, there are a couple that are about, as you can see, dotted about the place, but uh, they're all part of this old growth forest, which is massive, and that's a beast we're going to be dealing with at a completely different time. Uh, but before we start with Memory 2, uh, I said last time that we we're going to take care of both Albany and Two Bends, because Albany we only had the one area to go to, so I felt like to make it worthwhile, we'll uh, cover two areas. So starting out, I've made my way to the plantation, just because obviously, if one must do fast travel, um, it might, well, leave the area, it might cancel the event. So we're here at Ash Creek. So, we're going to head over here first of all, and we'll infiltrate the outpost and grab the supplies, which you should hope have enough room for, considering that the cargo storage is uh, maxed. Um, right, I see one target over there. One keyhole brushes in. Alright. Oh for goodness sake. Ah, coward, what are you doing? Right, who's this guy up here? He can't even see me and he's still causing a nuisance. Oh, you missed. Just go, dude. No one rings the bell. No, 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 no. You ass. Right, I'm gonna try and get my other, um... Sound kill with the wrong blade thing. Right. I still need another one. Okay, I'm gonna need a blade, yep. Is there even a challenge for in this game? I know, obviously, I knew it was in Black Flag. I can't remember if it was in. Um, uh, the salmon killed three agile guys with it. So I might just need one more. Okay, no worries. Right, so it's one of the guards. Right, I'm trying to get this fragment up here, just as we're around. Okay, up we go. Come on, Shay, climb that. Come on, just climb it, you fool. Why are you having difficulties? My word. Come on, just jump. What are you doing? Go. Oh, my. Thank you. Lead Nora. Boy, come on. And there's the other one. Oh dear, oh. Get the bushes. Felicien, there's a mission special for you. Follow me. You can unlock new possibilities. Mm-hmm. 
Right. Let's get them houses raided. Uh, what is this treasure? Thank you. Don't worry about it. I'm getting out of your hair. You don't need to worry about me. Alright. Easy as that. Well, say easy as that. You get spotted. Shay, you can grab that. What you, why are you picking him out? Oh. Most profitable plantation, but we'll do. I don't know why he's not. Why is he not sprinted? I'll try something, there, guys. I didn't turn my thing off today. I did. That'll explain it. <laughs> there we go. That's a bit better. Ready and willing to do some good work, kind sir. Mm -hmm. Sure. Go ahead. Take my well and supplies. You're a bastard. Okay, nothing in there, is there? Got you know it. Unique way of uh, making sure people renovate the properties. They hide the uh, inside. Okay. Up here. Come on. Right, there's a chest back here as well. Um, on the outside, obviously. Stop. Oh my god, Shay. Come on. This is like a problem they had in the old Assassin's Creed that uh, Rebecca apparently edited out with the uh, desire to climb over everything. But apparently they, uh, they didn't get that upgrade in Abstergo. It's a bit ridiculous. Oh. Alright. No uh, fragments on top, is there? Well, I guess we'll find out. Okay. Beautiful. And now we'll hop down. We've got a uh, Viking sword down here. Which is quite odd that we call this a quest item, because it's not. It's there's, there's no quest that requires these. It just unlocks a collectible. This is more like it. It is more like it. Well done. Well, I guess it's sort of like a quest of its own, but not necessarily in like the sense that we know the quest. It ain't one. So let's see. So we've got one more chest. We've got two more collectibles. I assume one's probably a fragment. Also, we've got another prosperity reward over there. Right, I hope I just hope it's not back in the um, plantation area. No, it's not. Oh, there's another chest. Oh, there's... Oh, I got it mixed up, didn't I? That's silly, isn't it? What did you have for? But alright, nice and uh, quick area. Less than 10 minutes. And we've still got another a lot of islands to go to. I prefer if we got them all done in this one episode, but it's, I, I don't know. Well, it is, the other ones are just mainly go and get a look and leave. There's no real stealth element to it that you've got to keep in plantations. There you go, Ash Creek completed. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh yeah, we've only got actually another two locations that way, so we could get it all done in this episode. So we got Red Bank. Oh, no, oh yeah, I forgot. My apologies. 
We've got a nice sort of notification popping up. It will not fast travel. Okay. There is another sort of... Well, it's similar to a plantation, the uh, cargo supply things. Uh, which you saw, it saw a lot like a wagon on the, um, on the marker. Oh, lovely, lovely rain. It cools us down. Yeah, supply camps. Um, so they're sort of like that, except, um, well, they don't have keys or anything. You're just going to basically sneak through, well, or just attack a whole group of people and then steal the supplies. Not bad, not bad. Okay, so at least we've got the, that just straight away. We've got the hunting challenge over there. Now let's grab this first, just because there seems to be different islands. Well, not different islands, but you know, separated in that sense. Oh, we're gonna do it a stop somewhere. Where are you? Come on, buddy. Oh, come on, I should not have alerted everybody. Well. Damn. You were not expecting them sweet moves, were you? Alright, let's try and clear the area as much as we can. Ooh. Damn, son. Come on. Oh my god, these guys are the worst guards ever. Oh. That's going to draw everyone's attention. Alright. You're, you're the only left side. I don't got that one by now, but... Well, you know. Okay, uh, right, so we need to probably go up there, I should think. Alright, beautiful. And, we'll crack you open. Not bad, not bad. Not as big a payload, but definitely a lot easier in the warehouses, so, in general. Plus you get money from these ones as well, so... It's quite a worthy... thing to grind out if you need supplies. Yeah, this will be another deer uh, hunting challenge, won't it? Which, as we found last time, you is very fun. Alright, yeah, we'll collect deer pelts. Please don't have five. Oh, well, it's five. What do you know? Right. Basically, the only way to do this and keep your sanity is to do it with some relative stealth to it, because they are they run all over the game, I'm sure. One over there. There's a cave baiting over there. I'm no one near you, dude. Come on. What are you running around for? I can't get any high. If I want to do this stealthily, you're just going to have to not see me. Alright, I want to get that one. Oh, uh, there she goes. Come on, come to me. Just be so slightly quicker so I can't actually get you. Utterly, utterly hate the deer hunting challenges. I really do. This is one over there. Better not spot me. Gotcha. Okay. Any others in the immediate area? Apparently not. Oh, there's one there. Um. Is there a way to get up there without alerting the, the deer? Can we keep some distance? Got him. Mm 
Hmm. It's quite spread out. Grab this as we're going past. I didn't even touch the circle, so... There's no one near anything I can jump off and assassinate them. Which is very annoying. Move over there. Okay, this one. It's coming, it's coming close. Don't stick me out. Alright, we'll do the one go. It's disappeared, never to be seen again. But he's not around. There's literally none around. How the hell am I supposed to do this? Actually, no. It was quite little. There's one. Slow as fool. So, no, no, don't go down. No, he's busy gone, ain't he? Oh, my word. Why are you. Come on. I can't believe we're getting so close to losing this thing. We need one more. Come on. This has been terrible. Oh, there's one. I'll just run off. I don't know why it doesn't quick shoot anymore. That would have just that would have solved it right then and there. It just quick shot that deer. Oh, there's another one coming close. Man, now you have to waste a, waste a bullet. Oh my word! Well, that was bloody close. <laughs> that was ridiculous. Oh, I actually, oh, I cannot, I cannot stress enough how much I hate the deer, um, hunts. It's, they're just awful. It's borderline, it's very luck dependent. I mean, especially in that one, like, there, 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 there are hardly any of them around. Right, not quite done though, because we've got a temple on cross just over here. So you know, with so few things to do, it should not have taken the, sort of like the same amount of time as a full-on plantation with like double the collectibles. Oh, see, here they all are. I'm chilling over on this side of the settlement. Where, where are we going here? Oh, of course, that one's... Okay. Don't push it. Where are you? That's more like it. Alright, so that just leaves us with... Uh, Black Ridge. So hopefully, this one will be a bit quicker. Let's go. How much we've got to do here? Uh, we've got a chest, collectible, and a viewpoint. Literally one of each. This should be really quick then. However, there appear to be bears in this location, and bears we need. What the hell? There's a, there's a clash over there. I really don't care. We don't need them. Um... 
could say the British all they want, they could be thankful for a cut scene and then as soon as we, I don't know, jump when they don't want to, they'll be bringing the swords back out against us. It's quite odd that they'd have a whole location with just two collectibles though. There must be something else going on other than that clash over there. Very odd. Alright. Hmm. There's a cave painting area though. That's nice. I like cave paintings. Very pretty. Alright, yeah, yeah. I know. I really don't care. No, no, you won't. <laughs> Wipe them out. Survival of the fittest. Yeah, I know, I know. Oh, let me just to go cry about it for a bit. Uh, who are we getting up there? Um, wow, we're actually gonna go tree hopping to get to it. Well, just saying, hey, you know, we'll, um, we'll give you two collectibles, but you're going to have to earn them. Right, okay. We're going to take the time here, because we know how she likes to cock up the easiest things. There we go. So I wonder if that's literally the only other thing, it's just a place where you can do frontier clashes if you want to do them, which I don't know why you would really. There's enough science stuff for this game. Other than pointless battles where you get like about 500 quid from. Why have we still got the combat music? Come on. They're all dead. I love that issue. You have 9687 money in the bank. What do we got here? Okay, so I still have to see a bear though. That's odd. Um, right, there seems to be over here. It's a black bear. Right. How many black bears do we need? Crafting. Uh, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, great. I was thinking, okay, four, that's manageable. Oh, nope, nope, double that, we need eight. Alright, well, I'll get at least one on the screen. And then I'll get the other seven that I need. Or oh, however many times I need to re spawn here. We got one. Is that it? Is that the only bear on this island? It would appear to be so. Oh, there's another cosh. Come on, big boy. At all. We set a, a bear on them. I just uh, send one over to, to wipe them all because I really don't care about either of them. Okay, that appears to be the only bear. That's quite sad. A solemn, lonely bear living all on its own. This island. An entire round to himself. And, uh, yeah. Okay. Well, that seems to be it. I'm not going to bother constantly coming back and forth because I'm not going to entertain anybody. So there we go. That's the two Ben's region completely done. However, there's this little corner here which is quite annoying. So. I assume doing clearing St. Nicholas will do that. I don't think we'll have enough time to finish it completely though. 
um, which is kind of a bummer. So, what I might do is we'll head to the old growth forest and start making our way across. This is a big area, but definitely not going to get this all done in this episode because it is massive. It takes up basically the entirety of that island. There's like, I'm fairly sure there are three different docking ports for the Morrigan along this area. So, it's going to take us a while. And whilst my initial plan was to work through this and then get the memory done at the end um, of the next episode, I don't even know if we'll have enough time to get all that. Which is the, uh, we've got all the animals in this area. This week, two renovations, nine chests, eight collectibles, an assessment section, a viewpoint, two activities, and two quest items. Holy macaroni, and a Templar treasure. Right. We'll have a look into that. Uh, once we've got the viewpoint, just so I understand where everything is. We've already got past the chest, but we'll probably have to go back down this way anyway. And look, and uh, another hunting challenge. Way. Okay, brilliant. Actually, now that I think about it, this might be another one of those areas where the quest runs through it. So, I don't know. I don't know if I use if we can. I don't really start an argument. But I think we might just get a start on it. At the very least, we'll try and get the activities done. Yeah. Alright, well, I'll rescue this guy because he seems to be just an innocent man. Oh, you know what? Screw you. You're gonna let an innocent man die. The petty revenge. He dies now, I'm going to be very disappointed. Come on. I'm going to be a hero. If this guy falls, it's, it's, it's not my fault. See, he's French as well. You guys should be wanting to save this guy. He's only your countryman. There you go, pal. There you go, catch your breath. You're all right. Okay, we've got a chest here. Might as well grab that. Yeah, blind. We've got a. It's a busy area, that's for sure. If I'm not mistaken, I think this is where the Viking sword fragments come into play. So this is where the reward for that particular thing is. Which is what leads me to believe that this might be. Uh, where we go? I see. We go right down the middle. You got stuff over here, stuff down here, stuff down here. I'll actually, that might be uncharted. I'm not too sure. Um, uh, yeah, that, this is going. It's going to take some time, isn't it? We'll get started. We'll take us out. We'll take ourselves to 30 minutes, and um, then we'll just. Carry on next episode, I assume. Start off with the mission, grab whatever cuts we can get during the mission, and finish up later. through the neck, you just punched him through the neck. Okay, um... Oh, for goodness sake. Um... Come on, sure, just climb over that. Okay. Up and out then. No. <laughs> ah. <laughs> oh. This guy, I'm surprised you even made it to an assassin, actually, because you just like to jump on absolutely everything, don't you? 
no particular use at all. Well, just go, go in. Well, you can go in. There's a big hole in front of you, you just think, nah, can't pop, sorry. The shanty if there is one. We'll get the shanty and the wall letter and then I if she will climb it. I think we'll wrap up after that. That'll probably do for us. Oh, I hear a wolf. Oh you don't. The rap scallion. No, you don't. Okay. Fantastic. That's more like it. Go on. I don't, I don't care. Alright, let's have a look at our database. So, we have definitely got a wall letter. We've got a dead end. My faithful acolytes. Francois Macandel. Uh, K paintings, we've definitely got a couple here. We've got Looking Below. One day, the great spirit called to his daughter, the Sky Woman. He pulled up the tree so she could look down to the earth. It's beautiful, truly. Uh, swans, we got. From beneath the water. The swans flew up to meet the Sky Woman. They caught her and carefully set her down upon the new land. Mm hmm. Uh, I think that's it for that one. Cave. No, no, I just did cave paintings. Uh, fragments, did we get any other fragments? Just no, we didn't. Juno has nothing to say today. Chances have at least got the one. We got Holly, Holly, Ho. I think it's just the one we got, actually got. Uh, yeah. Okay, uh, people. This one's a change, don't think, no. Ships, new. Locations. Landmarks. And ship types. No, none of the above. Uh, Alright, progress tracker. Uh, we are at 42%, we have now done 70% of secondary sequences, 46% collectibles and 42% activities. So we're still behind in terms of the actual sequence, but that'll start to rise up pretty soon. Okay, that is where we're going to end it for today. Next time we'll start up with memory 2 of sequence 4. Uh, what, was it, what was it, Sods and Armour, whatever it's called. Um, Armour and sword, <laughs> of course, got it the wrong way around. Uh, we'll do that, grab as many collectibles as we can uh, along the way, finish up what we need to do, because obviously we'll need to finish uh, the inception of the two hunting challenges. Get those done. If we do get any other time outside of um, the clearing up old growth forest, which I doubt we will, but just in case we do, we'll probably take down Fort Soleil and uh, get through that. So, not bad, but before we wrap up, let me thank my amazing patrons. My £5 plus patrons are Ron Hyler, Ever the Snake, and Andrew Corbin. You can find links to their channels as well as my other £3 plus patrons in the description down below. And on the screen, you'll see credits on my £1 plus patrons. Thank you so much, everyone. It's truly appreciated, and it goes a long way to help with the channel, so I do thank you a lot for that. And if you wish to join those patrons, you can follow the link in the description down below to my Patreon page, where you can pledge up to £20. But you don't have to do that, because at the end of the day, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and also be sure to share the video. And I will see you guys in episode 18. Bye guys.